Hello everyone. Today we are going to introduce you to our astrologer platform in which we will discuss how a user can book their appointment, how an astrologer accept the appointment and fulfill the services, and how admin manages the overall functioning of the platform. Along with this, we are going to discuss what are the features available on our user app and expert app. So let's start with our user app. First you'll need to log into your account with your credentials. Once you're logged in, on the home page you'll see a search bar where you can look for the services below the search bar you'll find categories like kundali matchmaking daily horoscope and astro further down you'll see more categories such as mahurat vedic face reading numerology palmistry and tarot reading just pick a category to find an expert in that field next you'll see a list of experts with their names fees and the languages they consult in. If you open an expert's profile, you can also check out similar consultant lists below their profile. You can choose to chat or call them. There's a calling option where you can call an astrologer based on your needs. Simply select the category, choose an astrologer and make the call. There's also a chat option that works the same way as the call option. In the profile section, you can view your profile details like your username and age. The wallet section shows your wallet balance and transaction history and you can add money to your wallet. The chat section lets you view your chat history with astrologers. The booking section displays your booking history sorted by call and chat. There are other sections include the help center, privacy policy and terms and conditions. You can also delete your account and log out from here. So that covers the user app. Now let's move on to the astrologer app. First the expert has to log in the account with login credentials. When they logged in, there's a home section where they can view the requested bookings. Then we have the section of wallets where experts can view the available balance and transaction history. After that, there's a revenue section where the experts can view the revenue they have generated by calls and chats with numbers of total appointments, number of completed appointments and the unsuccessful appointments in which we have account settings which the experts can view with their profile including their name, experience, reviews, manage their availability, can update their category, bio, email, phone number and date of birth, chat they had with users, history, notifications, account delete options, terms and conditions, about us, privacy policy and logout. This was all about astrologer app. Let's move ahead to the booking process in which we will learn how the user booked the appointment and how the experts will fulfill the request. To book an astrologer, the user has to select the category of astrology first or they can also search for an astrologers by their name. Click onto the profile of the astrologer Select for whom you are making the appointment. I am selecting for me. My details are automatically fetched. Now I have to add time of birth, place of birth, gender and then proceed. Once you confirm the booking, the experts will receive the booking request. Astrologer accept the request and start the consultancy services. When the call ends, the request will automatically go to the history of the user and the astrologer and the consultancy fees are automatically deducted from the user's account and added to the expert's account. With this our booking process is completed. Now let's move forward to the admin panel. To start, the admin has to log in with their login credentials. First we have dashboard where the admin can view the number of the total users registered on the platform, total consultants, total request, overall revenue, sales analytics. We can filter it monthly and weekly and list of the recently added consultants. Next we have section of apps. In apps we have further subsections. Configuration in which we have a section of service types where we can view the services with their name, description, color code, availability needed and there's also a section from where we can edit the services. To add a service type click onto the add button, add service name, add description, add need availability pick a color, service type and click on the create button. Next we have category section. Here we can view the categories of the astrology listed on the platform with their name, child category, 
it is enabled on front end or not enable services type and we can also edit and delete a particular category to add a new category click on the add button add category name pick color code secondary color code choose wants to enable it or not and description choose whether we want to show it on front end or not upload image upload icon and click on the create button and the details will be saved after that we have the list of custom fields in which first we have a section of listing where we can view the custom fields list with their field name field type want to show it on sign up or not we can also edit or delete the listing to add a new custom field click on to the add button add field name select field type select field text type select whether we want to show it while signing up or not submit the details After listing we have a section of user custom field same as listing. Let's move on to the users and review section in which further we have consultant sections where we can view the list of the consultants registered on our platform with the detail included name, contact number, service category, profile type, is he super expert or not, consultant is approved or not. Along with that we can also edit their details, delete their account, change password and view their details to add a new consultant click on to the add new button add email address select if it is a super user or not add name password country code of the consultant profile type phone number experience of the consultant category and submit the details then we have a user section where we can view the details of the registered user like their name email phone number total request they have made from where they have registered details as they approved it or not along with that we can edit their details delete their account and change their id password after that there is a review section from user with the details like user name review comment rating astrologer name and comment at date after users and reviews we have a section of marketing first we have banners where we can view the details like banner type banner of details sp name category of the banner class position of the banner start and end date of the banner mobile image and banner status to add a new banner click on to the new banner button select date range choose web image mobile image select user category service provider from whom you are running marketing banner class status banner type banner form position of the banner and submit the details it can be an extra source of income for you we can charge commission from service providers for this after that we have a coupon section where we have coupon details like coupon code start and end date of the coupon max redeem limit minimum redeem limit max redeem discount category of the coupon service type discount unit and discount value To add a new coupon click on to the add coupon button select date range add coupon code select category of the coupon service type discount type discount value minimum discount value maximum discount value limit of the coupon and submit the details after marketing let's move on to the setting section first we have a service section where we can view the type of the services we are offering like audio call and chats Next we move on to the pages section where we can view the page list with title slug of the page author's name status of the page app type updated at date we can also view edit and delete these pages to add a new page click on to the add page button select slug type title of the page body of the page select status select app type on which we want to show it and submit the details Next we move on to the app setting section where we can view the details of the app including app logo background color of the logo and we can also edit the details Then we have variables under settings where we can view the variable type key of the variable variable value and status Next we have the section of FAQs where we can view the list of all the listed questions on our platform with the title description and image To add a new FAQ click on to the add button add title description upload image and submit the details lastly in settings we have a section of app version 
where we can view the app version updated on Android and iOS. To add a new version, click onto the Add Version button, select Device Type, App Type, is it for Users or Vendor, Version Members, Version Name, select Update Type Minor, Major or No Update and submit the details. Next we have the section of Features in which we have Payment Gateways where we can view the available payment gateways. After that we have a Keys where we can view the FCM Server Key. Let's move forward to the Payouts where we can view the list of payouts with consultant name, status, amount, transaction ID, comment, view details and edit the details. Lastly, we have the section of subscriptions where we can view the detail of subscription plan with name of the plan, description, price of the plan, duration of the plan in months and status. To add a new subscription plan, click on to the add button, select date range of the plan, upload web image and mobile image, select user type, category, service provider who wants to give subscription for the services, class of the plan, banner type, banner for position of the banner and save the details. With this we are concluding the demo of our astrologer platform. After watching the working of these two applications and feeling inspired to launch your own astrology app, then we at Royo are here to help you. With over 5000 satisfied clients worldwide, we are experts in software and app development. Contact us by clicking on the link given in the description, fill up the form with your name your email address, your contact number, click submit and your query is registered with us. Our team of experts will be happy to answer any questions you have. Thanks for watching this video. If you like the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe.